Um, right, I'm, uh, hi, I'm Nikita. And what I'm going to talk about today is quite similar to what Karthik said. So I'm going to do a little Hindi version of it. I just hope everyone understands Hindi. If there's anyone who doesn't understand Hindi, I'm happy to go ahead in English, okay? So I'll uh, just, yeah, raise your hand if you don't understand Hindi. So I'm gonna throw a question out there because I'll give a little context. I run parenting courses and yesterday I did a session. There were 10 parents in the group and we were talking about how do you identify something special in your children? And um, they couldn't answer the question. So I said, okay, well, what is special about you? And there were 10 people attending the course uh, and nobody could answer this question. So I'm gonna throw this question at you guys today. Um, if you can just raise your hand and probably Kiran or Karthik, you can um, bring them, spotlight them. What is special about you? What makes you special? So quickly, people can raise their hand. I can bring them under spotlight if you want to participate. You don't have to, you don't have to feel shy. I think that's a great. Somya, yeah. Somya. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> Somya, you can unmute and share quickly. Okay. I always uh, like to try new things. <laughs> Brilliant. Okay. <laughs> That's, uh, I think, but I don't, I don't settle at one thing. Shraddha. Great. Shraddha, Revati, you can also unmute and share. Um, I think I'm very compassionate because when compassion is something which is very rare nowadays and I feel it is one of the best qualities which I know I have. Okay. Revti, what makes you special? Um, I consider myself to be very plain and simple from the heart. So I think this is something, I mean, I don't know if it's innocence or uh, uh, whatever it could be, but I think I'm special. Yeah. Okay. Anybody else? Go on, Sunil. Yeah, Sunil is yeah. there. Uh, I think I am, uh, uh, I was... Uh, Earlier, I okay. used to not read the books. Okay. When I started reading book, I understood uh, if we think a lot about positive, okay. that means we are missing something. So stop reading positive and embrace what are the negative things. That is a good going uh, and accepting yourself. I think from that time onwards, instead of reading on the positivity, accept what are the negativity mm -hmm. and uh, start from there. And uh, what I believe is... Uh, Instead of getting motivation and taking action, uh, take action. That action will motivate you to take next uh, step. So that's what I started doing. I think I'm special in that. Okay, so you're special in taking action, basically actioning whatever you, you believe you want to do. Is that right? Okay. Um, yeah. So we have 24 people attending and only four people could answer what is special about them with budget now. Um, Chitish, uh, can I ask? answer, Nikita? Yeah, go on. Yeah, I think I'm a person who is uh, very patient, mm -hmm. who is having a lot of patience. And I found that sometimes having a lot of patience is also not good. <laughs> yeah. Okay. That's it. Yeah. Okay. Um, I'm going to just give a brief answer. Oh, sorry, Shitish. Oh, I, I didn't know um, who answered earlier. Yeah. yeah. Basically, I was thinking, uh, I'm just thinking like, uh, I am a uh, like, great learner and uh, definitely I'm always keen to learning and mm -hmm. never give up kind of thing. Always, uh, you know, it's like going on in my mind. So mm -hmm. I started this book club about like six so one month back, I tried mm -hmm. some, something my own, so I, I couldn't join on that time, but yes, uh, I've always just keen learning on that, and uh, definitely the team and all each and everything is like very lovely. So about learning, yes, I'm being positive, new okay. things, so okay. yeah. Um, the reason I ask this question is because we are made to believe, uh, just like Karthik was talking about it, we are made to believe that there's a certain set of things as a box. If you fill in, if you fit in that box, you are good. If you don't fit in that box, you're not. You don't. And these um, conventions are defined by predefined by society. If you don't fit into that box, you're not good enough. 
And this is what we grow up to believe. Um, and Vijay has covered this topic several times in loads of PIM sessions that schools don't necessarily cater to different styles of learning either. So if you're not good at certain math, science, um, um, you know, um, languages, all those subjects, then you're not good enough. Um, these kind of conventions make you believe one way or the other. And I had that kind of belief. People tried to instill that belief in me that I was not good. And um, the way I overcame that belief or the way I could, well, rather I didn't believe in those things was because of something what my father said to me. So I was, you know, what, what makes me special is the fact that I don't listen to anybody. I don't, I have the courage to stand up for myself. And this is something what makes me not fit in the box because it causes a lot of inconvenience to adults around me, especially my teachers when I was younger. Um, or even now my bosses or people around me find it inconvenient to deal with me because I go with my ideas, my opinions, which are quite strong. Um, if I have to put a positive label on it, I would say I'm strong will. If I have to put a negative label on it, I would say, Ye kisi ki nahi sunti. this is what I heard all through my life. And um, my teachers used to complain a lot about me. I remember I was in year two when you just learned to read and write at that stage. My year two teacher phoned up my parents. Well, she reprimanded me several times because when you are learning to read and write, uh, as teachers, you know, you write like this on a page, right? I used to write from here all the way to here. This is how I used to write in school, always. This is how my notebook used to be. And Jabi correction, Kelly, you give your notebook to your teacher. My teacher used to put a big cross saying, this is not right. And I used to argue, but it's sahi to likha hai. She's like, but why can't you fit in one page? Now, this argument went back and forth. I was punished several times. I didn't listen. I still kept doing what I thought was my style. My parents were called into school. That's when I felt bad. When my parents came back home from the parents' meeting, um, I stood at the door and I looked down. I was ashamed. And all I said is, sorry, Papa, uh, I will listen to my teacher. So my father approached me and I was looking down. I was so ashamed. I didn't want to make eye contact. He just kind of lifted my chin up and he said, So I said, So he said, we did a hearing test on you. Hearing test ki thi aapki. Aur aapke kaan to sahi salamat hai, sunai to deta hai aapko. I said, yes, sunai deta hai, papa. Lekin teacher jo bolti hai, sunti nahi hai. Iska matlab jo bolti hai, teacher ne jo bola hai, mein wo karti nahi hu. So my father said, wo pata hai kiyo? To mein nai kaha kiyo? He said, hum nai hearing test to kara liya tha. Aapke jo cute se do chote se kaan hai na? वो तो काम करते हैं पर ये जो छोटे कान है उसके बीचों बीच एक बड़ा सा दिमाग भी है तो मैंने कहा फिर ही सेड तो अगर सबकी सिर्फ सुनना होता तो भगवान सिर्फ दो कान और दो हाथ देते दिमाग भी तो दिया है वो भी इस्तेमाल कर लिया करो मैंने कहा तो मुझे जो करना है मैं करती हूं तो सब बोलते हैं सुनती नहीं है पापा ने कहा इट्स ओके सबकी सुनना जरूरी भी तो नहीं है अपना दिमाग यूज करो और ये भी नहीं है कि सबकी सुनना भी नहीं है Listen to what others have to say. Sabki suno. Fir apni, apne dil se pucho. Ye sahi hai ya galat hai. And if you have an alternative that is either better than others, then do what you feel is right for you. So bas dousro ki sunna is not one option. Bas hamesha rebel karna hai. Isliye khud ki sunna is not the option. Compare all the options that you have. And then fir dil ki suno. So this was what my father told me when the whole world branded me a so I think when we have limiting beliefs put in us, just pause once and think, is that limiting belief real or was that instilled in us because we didn't fit into a box? It was probably creating inconvenience to somebody else. So somebody's inconvenience should not be something that prevents you from being who you are. So that's about it. Thank you, Kiran. Amazing, Nikita. Highlights. Highlights of uh, your talks and definitely uh, uh, no words to share. Share. I'm sure uh, people have received the message. The message has went through them and the message has been passed beautifully. Amazing, Nikita. Really, really uh, lots to learn from all of uh, from you as well.